Okay, in this next tutorial we're going to show you how to add some audio and also a picture to a quiz. But anywhere where you see the HTML editor, you can add audio or pictures in Moodle. So, we'll just show you this time via the quiz module. Okay, so you log in as a teacher and turn editing on. When you do so, uh, you go down to where you want to create the new quiz and click on add an activity or resource and choose quiz in this case. Then you click on add. When you do so, then you are taken to the page here adding a new quiz to quizzes. Remembering that this is the link to the quiz that we talked about when we first created a quiz. Now you have to add the name that the students will see and in this case we're doing audio and multimedia quiz example then you add some descriptions and choose the uh, various options that are available to you here uh, we covered those in the previous tutorial and you click on save and display and we get to this screen we want to edit the quiz as at the moment we haven't added any questions so we go to the uh, edit quiz page and click on create a new question and here we see uh, we can choose a multiple choice question and click on next and we do so we come to the question page now it says here audio uh, we have to remember this name so audio okay passed last night where did it go okay now we want to uh, create the audio file so what I'm going to do is just quickly show you uh, another free program called Audacity and how you can create audio with it. So here we have Audacity uh, and I'm going to create uh, an audio file. Click on re record. Well last night I went to my friend's house. He was hungry so I we all decided to go out to a restaurant for dinner. It was a really nice restaurant and the dinner was great. It was a wonderful night. We click stop and then we export this as an mp3 file. OK. We've exported it to audio. And save that and OK. Now we have our audio file. Go back to here and we're going to open up this HTML editor so that we can see these other parts that we talked about earlier in an earlier uh, tutorial. We're going to select just the period there. We can select any section of uh, the text but we're just going to choose the period here. Okay, and we're going to click on insert a link. When we do so, we're offered this page here and we've got to find the file. So we click on browse we're going to upload a file and click on browse again to find the file in our uh, computer here. There it is there. Dinner. And we open that up, upload the file. And we can see this file in here. We insert it. Now we put the question, where did he go last night? Okay, so now we want multiple answers because we're going to have uh, multiple correct answers. Now, to a friend's home, yes, that's partly right, 50%. And to a restaurant, okay, another 50%. It has to have two answers for the correct, for 100%. Didn't go to a movie, didn't go to another country. So we go through and we save changes. When we save changes, we can see that our question has been saved and we're going to add that. So we now have an audio question. And we can have a quick look at that here. And the audio shows up, students can click on it and listen 
and then answer the questions. Well, last night, I went to my friend's house. Okay. Next, we're going to, again, create a new question. Okay. And we are going to, uh, this time, put a picture in there. So, again, we have to open up the uh, full HTML editor option and we go to uh, insert a picture which is up here insert edit image so we click that ok again we have to find or upload an image we browse our hard drive let's have a look at pictures let's have a look at the earth picture here we'll open that and upload that picture now we can see this picture here we're going to just check the appearance Let's make sure that it's not too big we can make that smaller or bigger by changing the dimensions we can align it left or right and that all seems ok we might want to give it a description and then we insert that picture ok now what is the person in the picture holding ok we only want one correct answer here we have earth so we have to give that 100% we have some other options ok a bag, no, a pen, a knife, no we scroll down, we save the changes ok and now we have another, picture, uh, another question so we add that to our quiz now we have two questions in our quiz, we'll just preview it you can see question number one is on the first page and question number two is on the second page we've only got a certain amount of time to answer these questions but once we have and go back to uh, question number one to answer it Now you can see to, uh, to, a, to a friend's house. If we check that, now it tells us because we're on um, the learning mode that we've only got 50% of it correct. We need to get another one. We check this time and we've got it all right. So, uh, that is how you add audio and pictures